द लास्ट ग्राफ फॉर दिस मार्च स्पेसिमन इज द फ्लो वैल्यू एंड द बाइडो फ्रंट वैल्यू हेयर आई एम नॉट गोइंग टू गिव यू वट इज द डेफिनेशन ऑफ फ्लो हेयर ओनली आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन द डेटा दैट वट एवर द वैल्यू कमिंग फ्रॉम द डेटा एज सर्टन अमाउंट ऑफ बाइडर कॉन्टेंट इज एक्सेप्टेबल फॉर अस और नॉट because their definition their description i have already explained too much in my previous videos over here with each amount of this binder content i have this value for this value it is 2.4% 2.6% for 3 it is 2.6 mm 2.8 mm 3.2 3.5 and 3.9 when the two data are available to us means with the change of the binder content the amount of the flow is changing clear so that is why this amount we are changing with respect to this is changing so this is independent and this is the dependent so independent is taken along x axis and this dependent is taken along y axis now we will see how it behaves pv taken along x axis it is 2 2.5 3 3.5, 4, 4.5 and 5. And along this y-axis, same two, 2.5, three, 3.5, 4 and 4.5. This is the flow value. Flow is made in millimeter. It is taken along y-axis. Now we will start start plotting. With this two point five, it is the two point four. Its mean it will be like over here. With this three, it is two point six. It mean it will be somewhere over here. With three point five, it is two point eight. With four, it is three point two. With four point five, it is three point five. With this, it is three point nine. When these points are joined, we are going to get a curve like this one. This is known as flow versus binder curve. After drawing this curve. we have to go to our reference point and this is our reference point my this reference point is taken at pb is equal to 3.63% and i have drawn this line from this point and it is touching to the curve where it is going to touch to the curve i have to move towards y axis and it is going to touch to the y axis at this point this point is the flow value from this graph its value comes out to be 2.9 mm so so here we can say that with our this limit 3.63 percent the amount of flow value coming out to be 2.9 mm now we have to check the condition because this is a value taken from the graph with reference to this binder content we have to check the condition
कंडीशन मीन के इट इज एक्सेप्टेबल वट विल वी डू एज आई हैव ऑलरेडी एक्सप्लेन टू यू दीज आर द वैल्यूज सेट इन द टेक्निकल स्पेसिफिकेशन ऑफ द बिग सोसाइट नो टेक्निकल स्पेसिफिकेशन सीज द अमाउंट ऑफ एक्सेप्टेंस लिमिट इज टू टू फोर दिस इज द अमाउंट ऑफ एक्सेप्टेंस बट माई वैल्यू is well within 2 and 4 so this 2.9 is coming in between this one clear it first of all you will have to then think from this graph drawn between these two quantities between binder content and flow content with respected with reference to this selected binder content the amount of the flow comes out to be 2.9 mm because the flow is taken along y axis over here when this value is taken we can say that this value is acceptable to us or not means we have to check the conditions as i have already explained to you condition is seen through the technical specification of the project and this technical special specification of the project with the reference to which we are making the mix design the limit given over here 2 to 4 mm and our response is 2.9 it is well within the limit then we can say that our calculated value is within the range and it is acceptable to us and now at the end we reach to the conclusion all the properties required for the final acceptance of our binder as a mix design has been validated and now this 3.63 will be used for the development of the mix design which will be delivered to the site to be laid this was clear everything if you need anything please let me know i will again explain it up to this stage